Want to see something cool? I'm into outdated concepts that most people have never heard of, like logic, reason, critical thinking, and one of the best parts of this job is that I often get to review bits of my life and sometimes even get a do-over. When we ran the new cable for the Exciter feeds, I did what the boss told me and connected it exactly the same way as it was originally. It was fine, the old one worked that way without any trouble for a hundred years, but we're in the 21st century now and tradition is no excuse for critical thinking. So after reading your comments, yeah, I actually do that. I took another swing at the Exciter Terminations, this time with some modern upgrades. Just like with your mom, the second round was even better than the first. Let's swap out those antique bulldog fittings for some modern crimp lugs. We'll start by cutting off the ends. Always start with a clean tip when you can. Oh, it's like prom night. Gonna need to find one in my size. There we go. Turns out they come in Magnum as well. I'll tighten them down with my cute little hydraulic crimpers here to make them forever tight. Don't put your nuts in there. What's your SOP on this? Some guys use NOAA locks on these, but everything here is copper. Comment with your thoughts and bonus points if you can cite a source on it. Not only will we add a protective layer of heat shrink just to make it pretty, we'll color code it for polarity as well. This is DC, so red for positive, black for negative. It's only 120 volts, so we don't really have to fuss about with insulation too much. Pro tip, reverse these every six months or your slip rings will wear unevenly. The generator doesn't care about the polarity of the exciter, but the rings do. I even added a weather head. Yes, indoors and kicked off horizontally at a 90 degree angle to clean up the look of all this with the bonus of keeping the cables well clean clear the spinny bits. There! That's way more better and should rock on just fine longer than any of us are going to be alive. And that's pretty cool.